in this video we're going to focus on how we can create a logarithmic scale here as you can see this goes from 1 till 10 and then suddenly jumps here to 100 1000 and beyond that so let's start to look how to do this so let's start to look how we can create a logarithmic scale in chart.js so the first thing what we need is we need to go to chart.js2.com getting started this specific link here which you can find as well in the description box once you're on the site scroll down and just copy this entire chunk of code here uh, oh that's too much copy that and if you want to understand what this code does make sure you watch this video here that explains it all so then i'm going to just paste it in there once i did that oh, i guess cut this out and put that in here save this refresh there we are so now we have a bar chart here and just for the sake of it let's make it slightly bigger a thousand pixels there we are i'm going to convert this into a line chart that was a specific question so i'm going to put in here line save all right and then what i'm going to do is just going to move this and now i'm going to duplicate this a few more times so let's copy that entire data set and then i'm going to say here paste and then I put another comma and then paste again. Here we are. And what I will do is I will just change here the color code. So let's say this one will be a black line here. And this I'll just say yeah, the black sales. Then we have another one here. I'll make it the blue line. And remove everything except for the second one. And this will say blue sales and finally we have the red sales here i'm going to just remove that and remove this make it red save that refresh so now we have three data sets here but of course they are overlapping each other so what i'm going to do is i'm going to increase here and just make this a bit larger by adding two zeros at each item here and this one i will add three zeros and then we will see what will happen so right now, I'm going to save that. There you are. So we have this here, but of course this here wouldn't work really. So that's why we need the logarithmic scale. Luckily it's quite simple. Here, on the Y scale, comma, and then we just say here, type. And this type is called logarithmic. And then save that. Refresh, and there you are. So what will happen, of course, is because we proportion of the segments here or the ticks it changes slightly from 1000 it jumps here quickly to 10,000 and beyond and here from 1 to 10 and that's basically how you can create a logarithmic scale in a line chart or a bar chart or scatter chart those are the most common ones to use this so if you enjoyed this uh, video and maybe you want to put for example scale titles here or at the bottom to explain this more in that case i'm going to recommend you this video here on how to add a scale or how to add scale titles in chart.js